Hi, welcome to Angela's Pilates. So I've had numerous requests for some arm exercises. So today we're going to do the standing Pilates arm series. We're going to be using weights. You don't need very heavy ones. I suggest you go between one and two kilograms. Don't go higher than two kilograms. And just remember, although you're working the arms, you need to use your abdominals to maintain your posture. Let's start. So remember you need good form when using the weights. So you don't want to stand and lifting the weights and you're going to be leaning back. You don't want to do that. You want to make sure your shoulders above your ribs, ribs above your hips. So you need to engage your abdominals to maintain that good posture. So I'd like you to start off by rocking back onto your heels, then turning your toes out. Think about zipping up your inner thigh and you're going to close your ribs. You're going to lift your arms, bending your elbows and make sure your elbows, they're on an imaginary shelf in line with your shoulders. And remember, you don't have to use the weights. You can just use your own body resistance. So take a breath in and you exhale, you're gonna press your arms out and come back in line with the shoulders. Breathing out and in. So think about zipping up that inner thigh. Drop your shoulders and keep your chest open. Breathing out. And in. Let's do four more. And in. Three. Squeeze that inner thigh. Two more. Navel to spine. Last one. And now let's try lifting the heels. So come up onto your toes, lifting your heels. It's going to make you engage your abdominals a little bit more. Same thing. Reaching out. And in. Navel to spine. Breathing out. And in. Keeping those elbows in line with your shoulders. Long spine, chest is open, four more, and in. Three, squeezing that inner thigh, two, last one, and lower the heels. Now bring your elbows to the side, bring your palms inwards, we're gonna extend and bend. So squeeze that inner thigh, lengthen that spine. Open your chest, and think of reaching the weights away. Four more, squeeze in a thigh. Three, two, last one. Stay here, you're gonna lift your heels. Gauging those abdominals a little bit more. Same thing, extend and bend. Lengthen, navel to spine. Keep the elbows on that imaginary shelf in line with your shoulders. Four more four and in, three, two, last one, land your heels, bring your palms in, you're going to come in and open. See how we're starting to access the rhomboids, your mid traps, keeping the elbows in line with the shoulders on that imaginary shelf, so squeeze and open, four more, so your elbows won't touch but your weights will. Two more, in and open. Last one, stay here, you're gonna lift and lower. Open, close, lift, lower. Open, close, lift, lower. Squeezing that inner thigh, remember try not to lean back. Chest is open, feel that burn. Four more, let's go. Four, close, lift, three, lift, two more, last one, lift, now we're going to pulse, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, eight more, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and lower and release, beautiful, nice big shoulder roll, and we're going to face to the side, navel to spine, feet to hip distance, I'm going to face to the side, you can stay where you are, and you're going to place your hands in line with your shoulders. So bend your knees, this is our boxing, you're going to reach, come back to the center, and then reach, and back to the center. So keep your spine long, pull your belly button up and in towards your spine, and you want to think about reaching your hands away from each other. Reach, and in, reach, Coming back in, let's do four more, four and in, three, 
Try not to lock your elbows. Last one. Pick up the tempo. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, eight more. Navel to spine. Eight. Are you breathing? Seven, six, five, four, three, two. Last one. Roll down, just let your arms hang, tuck your chin, draw your navel to your spine to protect your lower back, and let's roll up slowly, one vertebra at a time. Pop your head back on top of your head, pop your head back on top of your neck. Pop your feet, hip distance, you're gonna bend your knees, and you're gonna hug an imaginary beach ball. Navel to spine, elbows lead, squeeze the shoulder blades, and hug. Open and close open and close squeezing imagine you've got a sponge between your shoulder blades and squeeze it elbows leading and they are soft four more four and close three accessing those bigger back muscles now last one and we're just going to hold it at the top and pulse eight seven six five four, three, two, eight more, seven, squeeze, squeeze, four, three, two, squeeze and release everything down, just let your head hang, roll up slowly, you're going to lift one arm, lean to the side and C-shape your spine, come back to the centre, think of length, up and over, come back to the centre, lifting up and over. Let's do one more. Try to lean right to the side, not forward or back. Back to the center and lower down. So bring your feet together. We're gonna rock back. Turn your toes out. We're gonna come into our zipper. So our weights are gonna touch. You're gonna lead with those elbows right up to your chin and you're gonna resist as you press down. Breathing in and breathing out. So squeeze that inner thigh. And think about zipping, think of a zipper imaging. A zipper image, zipping up and taking the zip down. Elbows leading right up to your chin and press down. Four more, lift and lower. Three more and resist. Make sure you're not leaning. Last one. We're gonna to come to our feet, we're gonna lift the heels as we zip up and then we're gonna lower them. Breathing in and squeeze that inner thigh. Elbows leading, squeeze. Lift and lower. Engaging those abdominals, otherwise you'll fall over. Four more, lift and lower. Three more, lift and lower. Last two, last one. Hold it here and stay there. Lift your arms, you're gonna place your weights above your head Look slightly down and you're going to shave. So pressing the weights away and pressing the elbows back. So like you're shaving the back of your head, your heels are lifted, navel to spine. Reach and coming back. Breathing out and in. Reach, press the elbows back. Navel to spine, squeezing that inner thigh. Reach and bend. Four more. Three, try not to lock the elbow joint, keep it soft. Last one, hold it up and lower everything down. Beautiful, nice big shoulder roll. Keep your heels together, turn your toes out. Palms are gonna face backwards. We're gonna press back and coming in. So this is our chest expansion. You wanna open the chest, feeling the resistance as you press back, breathing out and in. Drop your shoulders, open your chest. Four more, and in. Three, navel to spine. Two, last one. We're gonna lift the heels now, coming onto the toes, press the weights back, hold it. Look to the right, to the center. Left, center, and lower. Press back, lift your heels, look to the left center, right, center, squeeze everything as you lower down, navel to spine, press back, hold it, look to the right, center, left, 
Center, squeeze everything down. We go again, press back, hold, look to the left, center, right, center, lower everything down. One more set, press back, look to the right, center, left, center, and lower down. Last one, lift right up, left, center, right, center, squeeze everything down. So keep your heels together, toes out, relax the elbows. We're going to circle, lifting the heels for four, three, two, one. And we lower everything, arms and heels together. We go again, we lift the heels, two, three, four. We lower, two, squeeze that inner thigh and lift. So keep the circle small within the framework of your body and keep your elbow joints soft and lower two three four and lift two three four and lower two keep it smooth two more sets lift two three four and lower two three last one and lift two three four and lower two three Four. Beautiful. You probably need to shake out your legs. Nice big shoulder roll. Tuck your chin navel to spine and let's roll down slowly. Keeping those knees soft, just let your head hang. Let the weights pull you down and draw your navel to your spine. Then roll up slowly, one vertebra at a time. Pop your head back on top of your neck and open your chest. Beautiful. So try and do this weighted arm series every day. It only takes 10 or so minutes and you'll notice a huge change sculpting and toning your arms. Email me if you have any questions and look forward to catching you next time. Bye for now.